to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Darlene. Today we are going to be reviewing this right here. It is a chocolate melting machine. Let's go ahead and get right into this. Now I will be melting some chocolate in a little bit, but I wanted to do just the unboxing in here for now. So this is how it comes box. I'm gonna go ahead and take this out. It does come with two fuses. It comes with a charger. I have this right here. So you just want to unscrew this, I'm going to shut this, place this on right here, then like this. What do I do with the drill? Okay, and then I'm going to screw this in real quick. Okay, just like that. So this is the pan itself and it has a lid. I'm going to show you that. I do like how well packaged it came. You do want to take off these little plastic pieces before you cook with it. So just like that, super cute. And then you have your little main device in here. So you just take this off and you're gonna plug this in on the side. It does have the on and off switch right here. So you wanna make sure it's switched to off. And then it has the temperatures. You can go from 80 degrees all the way to um, 30 Celsius. So let me go ahead and as you can see, this pan is going to fit right into there like that. So it says um, to melt the chocolate, you want to turn on the temperatures 50 to 60 degrees Celsius. Temperatures can be raised or lowered based on the type of ingredients of chocolate and the change of room temperatures and the heating process is on a time is on at time. The red light is on. Okay, so let's go ahead and see how to use this inside the kitchen. Okay, so as you can see, I have this pot ready, so I'm gonna turn it on. And then it said to turn it to 30 to 40 degrees Celsius. So I'm gonna go 30, and then let's let it start heating up. It says turn it to 50 to 60 degrees Celsius, actually. So I'm gonna put it to six, no, I'm gonna do it 50 on the lower side. Okay, so right now it's heating up which I can feel it getting warm. I have it on 50. I'm gonna go to 55, um, just to make sure that it's in between 50 to 60. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in here. So you can see, just put all that in there like that. And then I'm going to get a little spatula and I'm just going to start stirring it in here start to melt slightly. The chocolate's pretty much completely melted now. So I'm gonna set it to 40 degrees, because that's what it says to do. I'm gonna start decorating. These smell so good, and I'm kind of upset that I can't eat them. Then I'm gonna get the cookies. Dip them in like that. And then put some sprinkles and then lay them down. Okay, and as you can see, that is what the final product looks like. It worked really well. This actually melted um, the chocolate down. It's still really creamy and smoothie and smoothie. It's still really creamy and smooth as you can see because it keeps it at the right temperature so you don't have to worry like when you're cooking about this actually drying out. Um, definitely something nice to have if you're someone that likes to bake, especially if you have kids and you like to do stuff. Normally I would help have my kids help me, but I didn't want this video to be super noisy, so I just kind of did it myself. But yeah, that completes this video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, God bless.